Well, hey, it's Bruce Latch. We're down at Timeless Archery Finishing, Grand Rapids, Michigan. Um, we're about ready to deliver this outfit, so we're not doing any finishing on it, but it's been completely refinished by my son, Corey, and we're getting ready to deliver it Sunday morning here about 8.30. We just figured we'd take a quick video to show you what it looks like. It's a beautiful mahogany um, table, and it's made by Rockford Furniture Company. It doesn't really say Rockford, Michigan on it, because um, that's probably 35 miles from here. Um, but we'll do a little research on it. We do know it's fairly old, probably 70, 80 years old. <clears throat> it's got some beautiful, did you show some of the beautiful uh, decorating work on it? It's got some down on the legs. <clears throat> yep, just a beautiful old uh, table. I love the the legs on it. And uh, over here is a matching hutch that uh, once again Corey restored. It's a beautiful uh, brown. It's uh, a light colored brown. It's not, it's not an overly dark brown or a reddish brown. It's just a beautiful little light brown, um, which is on mahogany. So this thing was probably bleached at one time. Otherwise, it would have been darker. And um, when you refinish bleach furniture, if you sand on it too hard, you'll sand through the bleach coat. Then you got a real mess. So if you ever got a piece that you strip down and it's uh, mahogany and it looks like it's lighter, a blondish color, um, if you have to sweat dents out of it or sand it too much, you're going to have problems. Uh, we run into that quite a few times on old uh, mahogany that's blondish and been bleached from the factory. So. And you got to re-bleach it out again. So, but yeah, here you go. It's a beautiful little. It's always a fun to do these little things inside. All, every refinisher has got to really enjoy doing these little pigeon coops in here, little cubby holes. So, but uh, yeah, just showing this beautiful mahogany outfit here. Thank you very much.